What's up, guys? I'm Brian Altano, and this is Max Scoville. Happy Life Day. That's right. That's what they call Christmas in Star Wars. Do they? They did a Christmas special. Yeah, and, the holiday, and George Lucas tried to find every copy and destroy it with a hammer because it was real weird. Dark days. Uh, this is not a dark day. This is an awesome day. IGN's rolling out a holiday gift guide for all the greatest gifts that you could possibly buy this year. Cool, crazy nerd stuff. Uh, we've been buying Star Wars stuff all year, or basically we all of our lives. We probably have a problem here. This is kind of bad. Obviously, mm. we're in the spirit of the season. Which is Star Wars season. Yep. And uh, yeah, you've been you've been going after the action figures more than I have, surprisingly. Yeah. So uh, what do we got here? So we've got a couple of different lines of action figures. In the center here, we have the Black Series. Now uh, the Black Series are they're they're six inches tall. They're pretty articulate. They're they're kind of chunky. They go for about twenty dollars each. Some of them have exclusivity uh, here and there. This guy right here is Toys R Us exclusive. He's the first order Snowtrooper. We got the kind of pudgy first order Stormtrooper that you can get on Amazon or pretty much anywhere else. And Finn right here with his trusty blaster. No lightsaber yet. In the center, we've got Jabba the Hutt, one of my personal favorites. A little throwback to Return of the Jedi. This guy, I think I got him for like 20 bucks. He's the same yeah. price as these guys. No, they're, they're pretty reasonably priced. I'm so lukewarm about these because they're they're six inch scale. Traditionally, Star Wars toys have always been four inch scale. Mm -hmm. They still do make those, but they're less collector oriented. They've got kind of limited articulation. Uh, I don't think we have any sitting around here anywhere. Nope. Uh, but there's there's plenty of other stuff too. You've also got your ever present Lego. Yeah, so uh, Lego is obviously teaming up at Star Wars again and doing a whole bunch of things, including Ray's speeder. This is a particularly cool set. Uh, it's, I think it's about 20 bucks, and you put yeah. it together, it comes with a little thug that she can fight. She can pop off, you can take off her helmet, look at what she Why looks like. Why is her like head on backwards? Hair. It's terrifying. She's got yeah. two faces. It's really nightmarish. It's terrifying. Then but yeah, Le Legos got, are always awesome. You got these guys from the, these are from the Disney store, right? Yeah, that's these right. So are these are slightly bigger than... Elite series. The big key difference here is they're made out of die-cast metal. Yeah. So they're like... If Hot Wheels cars were people, and you could probably club somebody over the head and give them sure. a real good lump, uh, but they've got you know they've got nice articulation, some pretty good paint jobs, uh, good stuff. If you want something that you can really just just, just hit your friend hit your with. friends over the head with, uh, Jack Specific somehow got the license to Star Wars and started making these these big, huge, my size Boba Fets. Have they made anybody else? They've got a lot of different characters. They have a few that are actually even bigger than this. I know they have a, I think they have a Kylo Ren that's about the size of a human toddler. Oh yeah, uh, that's right. We, so, you and I were in a Target together and I yeah. surrounded myself with them. Yeah, they got all kinds of Star Wars stuff there. There is no shortage of Star Wars uh, crap this holiday season. You've got some Star Wars Christmas lights here, Yeah, huh? I got an awesome text from my wife from the hardware store the other day saying, hey, do you want to cover our tree in Star Wars lights? To which I said, of course I do. Uh, right here we have R2-D2. The cool thing about these is these are actually shells, so you can pop these on any mm -hmm. sort of standard lights. Uh, I've also got C-3PO's, Stormtroopers, and Boba Fett helmets at home, so this is going to be this is gonna be a very Star yeah. Wars tree. And of course, this is all just stuff we grabbed from our desks on short notice. I'm actually wearing... ATAT -AT socks right now. Sweet. If you want some Star Wars socks, just go on, type in Star Wars socks, or check out our holiday gift guide. We've obviously got a ton of stuff there. There's also, you know, comics, books, oh, I don't know, the actual movies. There's Clone Wars and Rebels TV shows. All that stuff is available for purchase. You can get that. It's good stuff to give to your friends, and um, yeah, it's just a, it's a real, it's a real fun time to be getting real weird about Star Wars. It's pretty awesome to walk into stores and see Star Wars stuff everywhere again for the first time in a very long time. So uh, you can do that. Check out all the stuff we have right here and check out the full Holiday Buyer's Guide right here on IGN. I'm Brian. This is Max. Star Wars rules. May the Force be with you. Forever. This holiday season. But also forever. Coming soon. But for the rest of your life. To theaters near you. All the time, nonstop.